I'm officially stepping into the world of testosterone, not because I need validation, not because I'm chasing no Not because you need validation, bro. Be like dead ass. I couldn't beat him. So I joined him. Okay, that 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 that's one you should roll with. What is up everyone? It's Russo. I hope everyone is doing well. Today's ASMR spritz is some intelligent neon. Here are your noises. And then the ASMR sip is some disgusting cold brew. I'm not naming the brand I got from Target. So bad. Oh, as you can see, not a very enthusiastic sip. Welcome to another BS Cloud Grab. If you're just stopping in, be sure to subscribe with the bell on because I am vlogging my comeback. But Alex Eubank is coming back with a confession that he is no longer the prized Andrew Pure Christian athlete. I only drink out of streams. I never do anything on the, off the road. I'm tried and true. Yeah, he's been going nuts. <laughs> he's been going nuts, dead ass. He's been going nuts. Um, I've been following Alex Eubank's career. Andrew has one of those careers where he goes like this and then he realizes, oh, I'm going like this. And now I guess that panic has set in and he's no longer, um, well, he's an enhanced Christian athlete, so. We're gonna like just, you know, he's still using satanic, um, you know, medicine that alters the body and changes them out of the image of how he was created. Yeah, I just wanted to give this a reaction. I mean, everyone in the fitness industry is just like, this just showcases the route that degeneracy, lying to your audience, um, subjective fakeness is the way to go if you wanna get the bag and you wanna stay up there. And we'll see how Alex's cloud move works out. I ain't a player hater at this point. I just, I just watch the players at this point. You know, it's just like, there's no player hating going on over here. I'm just giving my honest licks. <laughs> For eight long years, I've been grinding, no short- For eight years, Andrew, I've been fully natural, just cornbread and bucking hay. I definitely haven't been taking in clomiphene or osterine behind the scenes. I've been completely natural. Four cuts, no excuses. Every rep, every set was earned the hard way. You see, I've heard it- Earned the hard way. When I started looking at the trend twins and spelling them down, I'm like, you trend twins. You guys are putting everybody on gear, I'm natty. I've been walking with my cross, bucking my hate. Here he is, literally completely 180-ing his audience that he built, like, woof. Not at all, you're not big enough, you're not strong enough. For years, people have clowned me. He's been like, I know I'm not big enough. Photoshops his pictures and takes in clomiphene. I know I'm not strong enough. Takes Hall Street, like, we get it, man. You've been lying a long time and you, you you doing the electrocuted dance and it's time to time to show up to what you've been doing. You literally this is <laughs> I can't deal with the hypocrisy. Obviously, I'm gonna watch and see how this goes and unfolds, but like bro, you literally built your brand off of clowning dudes openly enhanced while you're in the closet enhanced, and now you're you're spinning it like, oh. The insecurities that apparently weren't getting to me, Andrew, they got to me. And behind the scenes, I was doing all this stuff and now I can't take it no more and I have to do it out in the public and it's going to completely 180 my image and all my audience was built on what? Built on you being a natural Christian athlete. Okay. There ain't nothing about using pharmacology, especially the pharmacology you've been using behind the scenes and the photoshopping of the vanity biohacking looks maxing. That's not even real, dude. You are the testament that I should have just been a complete fake, dishonest, did whatever I could to get up there because it seems like you're going to stay up there with this move. But I'm wondering if you can handle all the souls. Let this man go from the most loved to the most hated fitness influencer in such a short amount of time. He's been wrestling these allegations for ages and denied. Andrew, these allegations are stacking up tonight on Cooked. Denying the fake natty rumors constantly. Some of you think you know what I've been through, but you don't. Every ounce of muscle, every inch. Andrew, you don't know what I've been through making hundreds of thousands of dollars a month driving my GT350R down the street at tw like 21 years old. 
<laughs> you don't know what it's like to move to LA and have all these sponsorships and all these hoes on me while I'm natural. Ship progress, it's mine. It was not handed to me. No shortcuts, no- It wasn't handed to me. That clomiphene, it wasn't, man. I had to drink the enclomiphene, bro. I had to take the Osnarine. Sheets, I say natural for eight years straight. Eight years of pushing my body to its limits. If you're in the same shit talk, the same doubts. Your physique isn't changed. Those spells were getting to me, Andrew. <laughs> On camera, I'm this brave Christian man in my bed alone. I'm like, I don't want to be dead. Uh, he's not our, he's already not natural, but I don't know. Like, now it's time to get juicy, bro. Demon time, bro. Bro, you need to bulk. I'm not here to please anyone. I'm not here to fit in anyone. I'm not here to please anyone, Andrew. I'm here to save my brand. My brand going like this, the money going down, my lifestyle. No, I move out of LA. I must take gear. One's box, I'm here for me. I'm officially stepping into the world of testosterone. Not because I need validation, not because I'm chasing. No not because you need validation, bro. Be like dead ass. I couldn't beat him. So I joined him. Okay, that 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 that's one you should roll with. Numbers or approval, but because I have more to prove to myself, the version of me you thought I have to prove that that was a shell of myself. I now will consume all the foreign chemicals, the demonic chemicals, and I will become a new Christian deity. Thought you knew. He's gone. And what's coming next? He's gone, bro. He's done. He's done. That's something you've never seen before. Um. Yeah. So this is, this is gonna be difficult. I've been thinking multiple ways of like how am I supposed to go about explaining this. To I've been thinking multiple ways how to lie myself out of this lie, which is built on a lie. And those five lies, I don't know if you forgot about those lies, but this lie, this the big Aikido lie that redirects my energy that's been killing me. And here I go, bro. It's time to get this over with, time to get geared up. To y'all of like what I'm doing and how I'm going about doing it, I'm going to be completely transparent open with everything. This whole series is going to be so you guys can like keep along and watch as um I change and I'm sure- I can watch as the demon inherits me. The Christian faith is bleeding out of my body. <laughs> he's like, what are you talking? Like, he's got this like, dude, you should see his soft light stuff. <laughs> Sure. People are gonna make videos on this. I know Greg will for sure. Um, I know Greg. Greg gets in my head the most. The little, the little pair. It's like, bah, bah, you know, it's just like, dude. No, I kind of talked a little bit about on, on, like, on his page. But I'm doing it in a healthy way. I'm monitoring everything. So basically, what happened is I was kind of feeling like you guys have known. I've showed my test multiple times. I've ranged from naturally 215 at the low. Andrew, I've showed my test multiple times. Naturally, I'm like fucked because I was this natty starving myself and I had to look like a broccoli. Well, I didn't have broccoli hair. I had, I had flowing lush. What's that one Um, Prince Charming from Shrek? Yeah, yeah, like he was going that direction. And now, you know, on enclomiphene, naturally, bro. It was like 800 on enclomiphene, bro. But it's time to go and get lost in the fucking sauce, Alex. Lois being shredded all the way to like 900. Naturally, so like naturally, not in Clobit, naturally. Nope, didn't take no enclomid there. Naturally, 900. 900. My job is, is for social media, right? Like, it's, it, I do better. I'm known for being aesthetic and lean. When my body is like lean and aesthetic, I feel like shit. I feel like less of a man. My sex drive is shit. my sleep is shit. bad energy, brain fog. It just isn't fun. Like, when you're when I have to be lean and like my test is at like last year, I tough it out. The natties unite. Boom, boom, boom. We stick together as natties. I know it's the hard, it's the harder road. I'm getting more refined. Not now, now you're just being honest about what everyone was saying. 300. It just isn't a fun. Like I don't like, I don't like it. But then when I'm a little bit more bulked up and fatty or fatter, uh, I feel a lot better, but I don't like that look as much personally. I'm I don't like how much dough that reels in, Andrew. Those bands be going down when I bulk up, bro. I need them bands, man. How am I going to get these LA hoes in my Lambo? Okay, I need bands, bro. I was like, if I could be 10% body fat or whatnot, like year round, but feel really good still. I have like a crazy sex drive of like crazy, you know, brain is dialed in all the time, really good energy, really good sleep. Basically all the effects you have when you are at a higher level of testosterone, like feeling like a man, like a good, like hard ass man. So yes, yeah, so I went to Overtime, which is a place in Tampa. They can test your testosterone levels in 20 minutes. So I got it taken, my blood taken there. Within 20 minutes, they had my testosterone results and my shit was like 350. They're like, 
Andrew, my show is like 350. Like I've been doing like little cycles in the background, but like just a big cycle and I can't lie about it no more. So like now I take gear, but like before, like I do little cycles and my HPTA never recover because I don't know how to do that because I don't want to try and Russo. Like now I have to take like the full big boy dose and like I can't lie at this point. So this is the time that I stop lying. Christian faith all the way. Like, tell me my options and like we can get you on test. And I was like, I was like, bro, we can get you on test, kid. Like, why haven't I done it? And I know I've made videos talking about, I was to always speak against abusing steroids. I always speak against that, 100%. But I've never spoken against TRT, right? I've trained- Ah, uh, one of these motherfuckers. Hey, man, it's TRT. It's not fucking steroids. Well, bro, is it a steroid you're injecting? Yeah, but it's TRT. Well, well, bro, isn't like, you know, TRT, like when you inject 250, you like never really endogenously make, bro, it's TRT, man. I ain't one of them juice monkeys. It's almost, I think eight years now, naturally. It's just, I'm, I was like, bro, at the moment, I was like, F it, bro. I was like, we ball. I was like, dude, we're going to do it. Um, So they pinned, they pinned me right there. Um, And it was great. The transformation was complete. Oh, <laughs> dude, how about a Come here, buddy. Come here and get the hot nurse out. Look at her. Okay, it's going in. Here's the Christian drugs, bud. And I'm doing that, HCG, and then I'm gonna be taking glutathione, or thionine, whatever it is. But yeah, shout out Overtime, bro. They were showing mad love. They were like getting me. Yo, shout out Overtime. Yo, this, they're, they're up in my bag, Andrew. Like, this is this, like, I got tests, man. You know, this is the bag, bro. Tip and update on everything. They actually are also available now, I believe, in all 50 states. So if y'all wanna go get your own stuff checked out. If y'all wanna give me a bag after I just lied to you for who knows, how long in the closet and now i'm out the closet and like i showed you where the the first injection happened but the, the the transformation when spider-man became venom was right here man so you can get the same golden syrup that i injected in my ass from these guys and whatnot I should, i'll have a link down below in the description if y'all want to go check them out get your own levels checked out they got like a whole variety of services they offer and provide. So they're getting me right. That's where I'm personally getting all my shit taken care of. So shout out Overtime again for actually getting me dialed in. Um, I'm, I'm excited. In terms of the part of me being transparent about what I'm doing, 200 tests a week, what we're starting at. Will I take a little bit more? Maybe. I think I'm- Andrew, the addiction starts. It's only 200, man. I'm looking at all those, like, I'm on Russo's channel scrolling, like, the high-performance ones, but I'm just like, just test, man, right now. Most I'd ever take is, like, 250, realistically, and that's pretty much it. HCG, some Cialis every day. 250 test. That's pretty significant, man. Okay, HRT's, like, what? 80 to 160 a week. You're, you're saying you're doing 250. That's that's performance TRT. You're still straining your biomarkers. You're still definitely knocking some lifespan, some life force around that. You shouldn't just be like, oh, it's only 250. You're, you're on steroids. You haven't been natty for a long time. It's just kind of, th this is funny. I'm not gonna lie. I'm getting real tuned up for this. Five milligrams Cialis a day I'll be taking. And then um, um be some trend. Kidding, I'm not doing that. Yeah, so. Okay, so he just did what's called like this weird hint off lie that Andrew, like when the views go down again, Eubanks on trend. Who knows what his porn up categories will be on that. So I, again, bro, I am so confident and I got my coach, my coach Alex, he's gonna be getting me dialed in that I'm going to transform my physique and all the people talking shit saying your physique hasn't. Okay, bro, like all the people talking shit, who gives a fuck? I love my little chained haters. Andrew watched me chain them all up. And I walk them around like, da, 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 da. like the fact that that shit gets to you, dude, is showcasing that were you bent by the entire internet to give up all morals? No, you weren't. You already were lying. You already were using enclomaphene, not Christian. You already were fucking photoshopping your pictures, just fucking disorganizing what the actual perception of your actual body was, not Christian. And you're doing enclomaphene to get that, oh, Andrew, my, my gorilla nuts were producing 900 tests this whole time. I definitely wasn't taking enclomaphene for that. Change, bulk, whatever. I'm going to take a quarter of the amount of gear that your favorite influencer is probably taking and have a- Dude, oh my God. I'm gonna take a quarter of the amount of gear. That's not how gear works, bro. It's like when you see those great IFBB pro physiques that's built on years and years of very, very specific cycling, blasting and cruising, being concerned about how many blasts you have and trying to get your set point base 
up to as heavy as you can. I can walk around 245. I may be a little bit fat, you know, but I can see my abs in the morning, right? And when I first started, I started around, you know, what well, it was like 198 pounds, you know, when I first started messing with SARMs or something. And I had to work that way up. Like you don't have a perception of the road you're going down. And I hope I, I am happy you have a coach. You know, this is gonna make it a lot, a lot more streamlined on your abuse, which you're not gonna just abuse TRT. Like this is what's piss me you're just like i'm on gear i want to try out all the gear okay i'm at the fucking gym candy store a hrt which is what he should do oh i'm not picking a b trt which is kind of acceptable let's be real you're gonna do d all the above you're gonna bump, 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 bump. that's all going in your cart to try okay this is an addiction you are now in a satanic addiction loop buddy the christian faith has been lost physique they could dream to have and I, I don't say that in like a cocky like oh i don't say that in a cocky way you're gonna dream to have this enhanced physique just like you're gonna dream to have my all natural christian physique and you guys were all hating on that while i was pop hold on a little enclosure to get that test back up to 900. he needs to be humbled way and i say that because i know I'm, I'm i know about myself whoever does think i haven't been natural in my life you're stupid i have been and my physique's actually gonna change now and i know with my like physique and my frame and the way in my in the way that i train when i actually am dialed in looking forward to something as i always have been for the last 70 years i know i know what i can do when i'm dialed in like i know and I'm, and I'm confident in that i don't mean that in a bad way i'm gonna take it in a healthy way and i'm gonna take way less the majority of people abusing and look better than them. And I say that in a humble way. Like, I don't mean that, like, in a bad way. But I'm going to show you all, like, you don't got to abuse the f your body. You don't got to abuse your body with gear, guys. Don't take gear. Month later, after the fucking money bag's going down. Hey, guys, you don't got to abuse your body with a lot of gear. Just a little gear. What's next, dude? What's next, man? This is, this is a train wreck that everyone... Oh, okay. The train is rubbing off the rails. Let's see what's going on here. Like, dude. And take gears off your life you can do this in a healthy way and i'm about to show you all that and i'm gonna look insane so if you want to stay tuned watch the series this is a brand new alex the old alex is dead he's gone the old alex is dead he's gone or was the old alex always hiding behind a mask and now the mask just don't work with this cycle we'll never know this just shows the state of the fitness industry that it's in it's getting worse and i guess i respect alex for like okay like andrew he has this natty card <laughs> i'm natty <laughs> And then, like, at least he's like, okay, here, here's the natty card forever gone. There, you did that. Again, bro, like, my type of persona, man, like, with the fire, like, when I see you in the club, and, like, Andrew, he's got, like, all these, like, L.A. hoes, each one's wifey now, and he'd be taking them in the Lamborghini STO, and, you know, like, this is a bunch of Christian stuff I'm observing after this first shot of test in the in the, the plug room in Tampa, you know, he's on the bed with his ass, just like, ah, you know, he's like transforming and shit. Like, dude, dude, what's going on, man? What's going on? Like, this is why like, I have close ones in my life and I'm grounded and I can go and vent before I start doing my public personified image as i don't know bro you on a ramp <laughs> i have a lot of friends that go on rampages man and i just hope it all works out you know when you're going to a club in la and you're showcasing to your audience you pulling these women and you know you're taking pictures of them in your lamborghini aka like i don't know a christian guy probably wouldn't use materialistic items to pull not saying like you can do whatever the fuck you want. You know, Russo got a white wing and a dark wing on his back, but it seems like both your wings turn black instantly and I just don't know how it's gonna work out, but I am very interested to watch. Um, I would say you actually ground yourself on someone during this. I hope this coach isn't one of those coaches that um, just blows smoke up your ass. You know, I hope he's realistic with your mental neurochemical changes that it's already over reddit sush buddy i'm already witnessing you doing behavior that is erratic and it's very reminiscent of me when i was younger battling something that i was born with you now have open pandora's box and it's not very christian like and again i didn't build my brand like that you did I didn't. And yeah, dude, that's only 250, man. And you might fall down the rabbit hole. I don't know. We'll see.
We'll see how good it is on you maintaining sanity, especially when you are very young, very successful with hundreds of thousands of dollars a month with the opportunity to amplify your platform even more after struggling. Um, I don't think you'll fall off. I just think, you know, it's better to be dishonest. It's better to lie to your friends. It's better to just do anything for the clout at this point because people forget people have a very low attention span and as long as you're it you're hot people will always be around in your ears to milk your energy milk your following and use you as a battery even when you didn't agree to it it's just like one of those things i see where i wonder if there's people around you making this jump for you because of the obvious money difference the obvious money difference of you pushing higher in your platform it's a whole new lifestyle if this 180 pivot works out and when i go to the comments you either die a hero or live long enough to see yourself become the villain facts good bar i like how you said you aren't doing it for validation but towards the end of the video you bring up what everyone thinks of your physique and then compare yourself saying you will look better than others beautiful bar by lex little what the fuck was his retort to that one because that's facts thanks for paying attention pal bro you're a public figure we're definitely gonna be paying attention to you being the biggest hypocrite i've ever fucking seen in the industry bro you have to be able to retort what lex said he won that, buddy. You didn't retort shit. He just fucking nuked you, dude. Alex reasons for hopping on. So he can feel like more of a man. So you can't have a crazy sex drive like a Christian. Andrew, I was saving mine for marriage. I wanted my little PP to be that perfect size that when the girl raw dogged in the club at LA comes up to me. I'm ready for my wife and I'm gonna post her all up in my Lamborghini SDO. I'm a poster with my vodka tonic that, you know, it's got, <laughs> I can't do this, bro. What the fuck am I watching? <laughs> he let the comments get to him. No, no, no. It's not the comments. I wonder if someone is in his ear. Hey, bro, it's time to go this way. Brother, social media fucked you up. Anakin joining the Sith. Okay, that, yeah, I'll end, on, I'll, <clears throat> I'll end on this one. Based on his snap stories with the new tattoos, buying a Lambo out of the blue, the horrendous diet, and now this. I feel like you're low-key going through a midlife crisis. You're out of control, brother. Sad to see the toxicity get to you. It's not the toxicity. It's literally like, okay, if you're Alex and you're making this fuck ton of money a month, and it's slowly... You're, you're back, like you're in the command center, Andrew, and you're looking at all your money numbers. Like, uh, like how's my brand doing? Up, oh, it's going down, and then you do the future projections. Up, oh, my lifestyle will be impacted at this date three years from now. It's time to get lost in the fucking sauce, Alex. How about you just fucking own up to the fucking piece of shit you were doing that horrid Christian branding for that long when you're going to do this crossover when you were big enough, you knew you couldn't fall off. And then you built a logistics around milking your following, selling testosterone. Hey, bro, I got this magic yellow liquid test. It's only TRT. You can get it too. Remember, I was like creating a natural army. We're the natural army, the noble natties. We're going to battle everyone who takes gear because everyone should get destroyed like us by the unnatural environment. So if you want to fucking join that and counteract what's going on in the environment, I hate you because I'm natural and I'm noble. You're not noble, Bo. You're not. You're not noble, bro. You're not noble. This is pathetic. It's like when you go to college and like you watch Blue Mountain State once and then like after you... You know, you take the Blue Mountain State programming, you're like, next thing you know, you're selling Coke, you're on benders. Like, what happened here, Alex? I hope you, I hope you navigate this to a point where this isn't regret five years from now. Who knows, man? We will wait and see. I will see you guys in my next one.